What is going on, people? Welcome back. Johnny here. We're playing some RimWorld. And uh, our drone is intensified. I don't have a good melee weapon for this, dude. I think we'll just... It does have a nice fire spew. Too heavy. What does that mean? Bio? Does he not do hauling? What do you mean? Nobody can haul those? Oh, I bet they're reserved. That's the issue. So it's not too heavy. It's reserved by someone else. Alright, well, we'll get some goodies out of this. Eventually. There it is. Alright, I'm gonna make these butt sniffers haul this stuff back as well because... This stuff can all, because I don't want to leave them sitting in the dirt. Alright, so Yegor, you are going to go consume pemmican. You can actually haul that, and you can grab this. Alright, there we go. It's a done deal. Drone destroyed. Oh, this is some gross pemmican, man. Sitting next to some carcasses. We have a lot of stuff to butcher, so let's make sure that stuff's not going to spoil. It is refrigerated, so we have some time on it. And then let's kick this on. See if we can get all of these mechs broken down. How's our power situation if I reconnect? We're doing fine, so let's... What are you making there, butthead? Making a duster. So I'm trying to get him skilled up with this passion. It's going pretty fast, but I think I want... Oh, he'll just keep working. Well, alright, I guess we'll force it. <laughs> Piss on it. Nothing but a bunch of steel. Right, well, that didn't take long at all. What the hell? Oh, that's debris. <laughs> I thought my chair was destroyed. Oh, jeez Louise. A little out of practice here, clearly. Did you uh, not just drop that on the floor? Let's double check those. Drop on the floor and... Yeah, okay. She just must have had some other business to attend to so the expanded workshop is nearing completion we're gonna put some doors through here which probably is gonna require some mining no because we have them smooth it is fine I'm gonna do something like that we can move them later if we need to and then we need a big charger and how's the batteries doing they're good Things are coming along nicely. We need a big charger. Uh, maybe this this big SOB isn't going to fit down here anywhere. <laughs> oh, it'll fit, fit there. I'm going to try and move charging stations down here only. We'll just see how that treats us. So, for now, we'll just run some power through here. Oh, I guess I do need to do some smoothing over here. I'm not sure how that was missed, but there it is. There you go. Okay, that'll solve that issue. And then I guess they're not going to smelt the rest of this stuff. Okay, so charging stations. I can get... Uh, these doors might not be in an optimal position. I want to remove one, but I also don't want to end up where Skyfallers show up in here and we can't get a person out that needs to escape quickly. So I guess we'll just leave it. What's going on over here with the roof situation? Alright, there's another... Okay, so drone intensifies. Psychic drone. Need mech rechargers. Yeah, you're not joking about that. Alright, between Ditch here and our other little bro. And there's a chunk. Good. A little bit more smoothing and then that whole situation is resolved. I'm thinking... We actually take these walls out too, but whatever for now. If it gets in my way, I'm not sure. Oh, I left this double wall because it's exposed to the outside here. All right, so let's do the charger the game's been begging me for for a good long while, and let's see if we can't get these bad boys popped down here somewhere as well. And then I, of course, we can always shift stuff around later if we need to, but there's no great location. The way this room had to be built due to the overhead mountain issues yeah, I think we'll just stick these in the middle for now All right, so it kind of sucks when they move them you end up with like double so it still has 42% waste now see that one dumped five waste packs and then it dumped five again and now it's at 88 fucking percent okay so try not to move those people I think that's the lesson there holy shit 
Uh, we are stuffing waste in here, so we have 58. I think I definitely did myself a massive disservice there. So, we need to do some brain scanning. So if we turn the power on, start the scanner, and what was this? This was a gestator, but it's only taken 50 power since it's offline. This is a subcore encoder for making smaller subcores. So much shit to figure out here. Things are getting kind of packed in here. We're not getting an issue with that. Are they extremely impressive? Hey, fucking hey, another bulk goods trader. These dudes are going to be legit. Somebody, okay, we also have a bunch of people with nothing to do, but... Um, I'm, I'm, I'm looking for social abilities. I believe our third dude, yeah, Ditch, can probably trade with the Confederacy of Bongholio Vago. There we go. All right, so we don't need meat. We did just have a bunch of animals we took out. So we're getting a little low on rice, which isn't promising. Now, this kind of stuff... I'm half tempted to keep so we can turn it into big fluffy chairs and stuff. I guess if we don't have much of it, we'll sell it. Light leather's garbage. And there's going to be more lizards around, so we'll keep on that. 80 is a good number to keep. Elephant leather. I think a chair. What is a chair? Like 120? We have to probably make another chair now that I think about it, too. We do have all the drogas we've been making. Nice. Signal chip. Animal pulser. <clears throat> We're not selling that. All right, so some crappy pants can go. We did make some dusters as well. We have gold. So we should keep some material for making additional clothing too. We might have to start doing some hunting just to get the material. Now, the issue I'm having here is that uh, they don't have enough money to pay me for all the stuff we're trying to buy. They also don't have any steel. They actually sell dye, which is interesting. We may have to end up just keeping some stuff. I'm probably going to end up keeping the light leather. All right, that works. Now, it was pointed out, I'm going to dump this, do this. So my new patron, I am violent, messaged, and I believe we had a quest, Dangerous Mechanator Lair. Well, that's interesting. <laughs> Whatever that one is, it clearly failed. Uh, hmm, nice. All right, well, I might have let it expire. But anyways, I was asked by a patron to see if we could bring in a sang sanguine, a, a vampire. <laughs> and we did have a quest to make somebody into a vampire. And I was like, well, we have all the blood, so we could probably accomplish it. So what we'll do, I, don't, I think that quest has expired now. We don't want that. We don't want that. Royal Ascent. Yeah. I guess it must have. I guess it must have expired. Well, regardless. I'll get on top of that next time one of those quests pops up. So the Royals, we're going to turn one of us into a Sanguinophage. And uh, that was going to be pretty cool. But now, it's been too long. So, yeah. I do appreciate the patronage. And I will get that sorted out. What do these take? 110. So we don't have 110 of anything. But let's go check for lizards. Yeah, there's a bunch of lizards around. And by a bunch, I mean two. Oh, gosh. All right. So we have a lot of... We're losing all this meat. <laughs> I am going to... Delete both of these zones. So the problem we had originally was that we were making too much vegetable food. Clear all preferred foods. No hemogen, no kibble, no pemmican, no chocolate. Uh, I guess baby food probably rots. Raw food, meals, no package survival meals. So these should be important. Okay. So, yeah, that sucked, but there it is. We've lost a shit ton of meat. All right, somebody's actually doing the hunting. So there you go. Oh, we could actually slay some elephants and get some more elephant hide and make a big chair out of that. All right, good. Maybe once these lizards are dealt with, though, we'll be in good shape. What are these? Let's deconstruct these and see what we get. Still have to deal with those... Uh, Oh, that's interesting. That that uh, let's just cancel it. It's 
got two hit points left, and that's just not a problem. Anyways, we still have to deal with the ancients that are inside these caskets. Did this dude go charge himself up then? He did not. Mm -hmm. How do I make that happen? Wake him up? Nope. <laughs> Dormant self-charge. What if we do that? There you go. So how long does it take this big fucker to charge? Goes up half per day. All right, well, that's fine. I like that the mechs kind of lay around in here instead of laying around elsewhere. Of course, I can't move the dude because my little mech leader dude isn't around. All right, we have 101 of those. It's not going to get the job done. Wildlife. No, not going to happen. We could go slaughter that elephant. It feels like a bit of a risk. I need to make a little bit of a friendly motion towards the tribe that we're really pissing off by throwing poison over by them <laughs> or toxic waste anyway. So yeah, we should consider that. We're not doing research at the moment either. I wonder if these little indicators are. Is that just saying that the source of that is royalty? I suppose so. That's saying they, yeah, so gold ones are royalty, greenish ones are biotech. Interesting fertility procedures. Oh, that's for human for or human like fertility. Well, we could jump into toxic filtration. I think we'll be okay without that. Uh, we did find bionics, so I think our boy here needs an eyeball and a leg. So we can maybe try that. Okay, I'm gonna focus on the leg first. He's got a pretty significant reduction. Scratch that to his vision. Not as <laughs> so. Also, we want to make sure. Oh, he doesn't have the skill yet. Mm, that was the problem. All right, Yegor, Yegor. Uh, not any human, any slave, any mech, any human. Okay, so I can't do this due to uh, my skill level. Uh, okay, let's make a couple more cloth dusters. That should get them to where we need them. Clear all. Cloth. One, two. Let's see how that treats him. Now, we still have to get out and claim that mechanoid's carcass so he can turn one of... Mechanoid? Mechanator's carcass so we can turn one of our people into a, another mechanator and expand our mech base. Uh, at this point, I'm not super enthused with how the poisons or the toxic issues go. I guess we can see if we can clear out some of these blocks too, or chunks into blocks anyway. All right, we're in a good spot, I believe. And then we'll keep an eye on the wildlife for some more lizards. Where's this elephant? This dude has no weapons. Who... I don't want to have to craft a sword. I'm going to wait until I can buy a decent melee weapon. We do have an elephant tusk, which may or may not be legitimately decent as a melee weapon. 6.89. Thrombo horn would be better, I think. <laughs> All right, so this dude is now charged up. This is using 400 watts, even when it's not actually doing squat for me. I can't hide a tick of power anywhere. I'll put it under it, I guess. Well, how's the power doing? If it's doing just fine, I might ignore for now. Ooh, neg 302, but the wind's not moving at all and the batteries are full. We could also build another battery. So, at some point, I need to summon in the next mech, but I was hoping to have a few more fighters. So, you're playing chess. Next time, okay, Ditch has nothing to do. It's time to fry his brain. <laughs> Alright, so reconnect. Uh, disabled. Insert person. The following ingredients must first be loaded. Is it set to a specific person right now? How do I do that? So, if I start it up, maybe I get that job to do it again. It's weird that they changed the entire way the game functions for this. I'm sure there's a reason. I probably said this before, but I just find that interesting and odd. All right. All right, I just manually make him enter. Here's a cold snap, which shouldn't matter too much. We are in a nice warmish climate, so I can't complain too much about that. Completes in one hour. 
and he's going to be pretty rough. He doesn't do much for us now anyway, considering we don't even have a weapon to equip him with. Okay. All right, there it is. So how's he feeling? Pretty shitty. Let's uh, Let's turn this back off then. Maybe the best time to do that is right after a raid. What was I storing on here? Raw resources, steel. That's interesting. <laughs> okay. It's interesting that nothing's ending up there. It's important. This one is important. There you go. Whatever. I'm not terribly picky about where it ends up. So Morris hasn't anything to do. I still would like a nice kind of social chill out area. I think we'll start working on... Uh, getting this area taken care of a little better. So why don't we, well, first, why don't we do some smoothing down there? All right, we've made the dusters. That'll hopefully get me where I need to be in terms of his skill. Look at that. It worked. Very nice. And now you come hang out in here. This is the mech. I wish you could put like a mech resting spot. So they'll just go hang out over there. Maybe they've added that at this point. I see nothing. Fire foam popper. We had intended on building one of those in here. So I think we'll get that going. That seems important. And we can now make another mechanoid. So a scyther, a scorcher, a pikeman. I mean, knowing what I know about these and the mechs that come and attack us, our plants are dying because of the cold. Oh, hang on a sec. Architect order. Let's do some harvest on that. All right, that should be fine. The harvester's up and at him. Anyways, knowing what I know about some of the new mechs, A, they're going to shoot a pikeman dead, and B, they're going to do that fire blast on this guy. I think I like the idea of the scyther because it'll keep our humans alive longer. Because, ooh, 75 fucking plasteel. <laughs> okay, that's okay. We have a bunch, so. All right, these were smooth. They were good. So let's stuff this down here. I'm just going to square it off. That little tick's never going to amount to much for us, so. And then, again, I'd also prefer to have the social area more in the middle, but we're kind of boned in terms of what we can do with this space. In fact, this uh, cold snap's not doing us any favors in terms of keeping our food levels where they need to be, but there you go. Why aren't the animals going over here? What's your zone? Okay, I guess they should be. Old structure caper. Meh, whatever. Need to put in a hospital, too. <laughs> it might be time to shift this stuff around a bit. I'm going to wait till there's no other construction jobs. And then I think we'll also do some mining here. Uh, is that even necessary? It is. So I want the door to end up in the same spot. Actually, we do end up with one extra bit of wall. Eh, whatever. We'll figure it out. And Morris will work through that, plus she genuinely loves mining, so that'll make her happier for a little while. Alright, so I can't scan this dude for a few days. I'm not sure how long it lasts. It probably says somewhere along the way. So this space was finished as well, and I need to figure out what to do with it. Lilu, alright. A crash baby. <laughs> Suffering from abasia and will be unable to walk. Well... She's a trigger-happy masochist. 36 fucking days. That's bananas. I don't think she's really going to provide us with anything we need. And our gear is complete garbage. So, yeah. Uh, just reject her. She, can, she made the wrong choice. I'll say. Okay, now we're being besieged. So, this brosip doesn't have a weapon. Well, why didn't we do this? I guess I have to force it. I just need everybody to come over here for a minute. We'll throw the mechs in. Nope, everybody draft up. I'm trying not... I guess we have to let them do shit. Uh, it almost might be wise to leave Jaeger behind since he's not going to be good for much, but whatever. 
Not Jaeger, sorry, Ditch. He's not moving too quick either, which means he's not going to fight fires very quickly. All right, we have to get out there. Come on, Mechies. So if you just do a drag select like that, it, it doesn't... Oh, I see. It does get the maximum. He does have a fire spew. I guess we can bring him out. All right, yeah, we can do it this way. This was painful, but... The Militor. How fast are these dicks coming along? Oh, it's the fucking dog dudes. Maybe we should wait for some of their supplies to drop. I'm trying to figure out where they're going to go so we can make a smart approach. Might get ourselves a mortar out of this. There it is. How many do they have? Fucking two. Great. Uh, do you have a lot of good weapons? No, I see a lot of shitty weapons. What the hell is that thing? That's a fire foamer. Yeah, in case it shouldn't be too bad. Be nice if my Scyther was ready to go. This game is slagging out really bad, and I feel like there just isn't a lot going on yet, even. Well, the Scorcher's ready to battle. You guys build that already for me? <laughs> as soon as they build, they start firing. You see a shoe and ditch. I guess you can just take up... Keep, keep taking up the rear. Yeah, oh, maybe it's just because it's in slow mode. There you go. Let's uh, ignore it. I hate to go. say it, but I am out of time for today. Please leave a like if you're enjoying. Leave a comment. I do read them all. I do respond. I appreciate you guys being with me today. We're going to have to creep in there and deal with this mess one way or the other, but there's a lot of them. There's nine. That means we have to drop five. So if we can lure them into somewhere else, so maybe we try and use our long-range weapons to pop a few of them off, run like hell. Like you go there and maybe you go there. Don't know that this is gonna work or not. Well, whatever, next time guys, I love you. Thanks for being here, I'll see ya.